Joey, why'd you shower with your daughter is giving the State of the Union address tomorrow, so here's some predictions. Old Joey's gonna be roided up good so he can stand and speak for 75 minutes. So he's gonna start fast and end slow. He's gonna go off script at least three times and he's just gonna go, anyways. He'll bring someone from each of the marginalized issue-related groups to use as a pawn during the speech. It'll be someone who got an abortion, maybe a they-them of color that has an engineering degree, and then maybe a Venezuelan migrant that didn't get arrested yet. Marjorie Taylor Greene's gonna wear like a feather boa or a top hat or something. Lauren Boebert's gonna give Matt Gates an over-the-pants HJ. Chip Roy is gonna look like he wants to headbutt somebody. Katanji Brown Jackson is gonna wear some glasses that look like they're from the 1920s. At least one Supreme Court justice will look like they've fallen asleep. Kamala Krusty Harris is gonna wear a brown suit like she's about to deliver packages for UPS. Alexandria Ocrazio Make Me a Margaritio is gonna wear a white dress and pink heels or something crazy. Maybe some glasses so she looks like a suffragette who's wearing white because she's so innocent. If Joe starts stuttering too much, Jamal Bowman will pull the fire alarm. And they'll be like, oops, I thought it was the tampon dispenser in the bathroom. Joe's gonna blame the border crisis on Donnie and Republicans who didn't pass a bipartisan market. He's gonna say we have the best economy in the world and inflation is down. He's gonna say the stock market is up and he's gonna say MAGA Republicans are ruining the soul of the nation. He's gonna say decency is on the ballot. He's gonna say restore Roe, we trust women, five times at least. He's gonna make a bunch of claims about things that he's gonna do in the second term that he won't do. He's gonna say ban assault weapons. He's gonna make some not veiled suggestion that Donnie is gonna be a dictator. That day in January will definitely be brought up. He's gonna do that creepy whisper thing and probably say something like, finish the job, let me finish the job. Jill is gonna wear a white dress with yellow flowers, very tablecloth vibes, as usual. Press secretary liar Kareem Abdul-Jabbar will be there and she'll be wearing a weird color that seems like it would be nice and classy, but it just won't be. And it'll have weird pockets or like a weird lapel or too many buttons or something strange. It'll be like bronze colored or auburn or like robin's egg blue mixed with poop. Hakeem Jeffries will be there, and every time they cut to him, it'll look like he's asleep with his eyes open. Ayanna Presley will be in the audience, and, and some Gen Z teen that just saw The Matrix recently will be like, Why is Morpheus in the crowd? <laughs> Chuck Schumer will be there with his glasses at the absolute tip of his nose, like they're at the brink of falling off. And when you look at him through the camera, you'll be like, I know what he smells like. And if he, if he says a single word or if he mouths a word, you'll hear what he's saying in your head. <laughs> Joey Basement's gonna say something completely and blatantly untrue and just because no one has any decorum anymore and we're living in a clown show, someone's gonna yell something like, Boo! No! Or close the border! Or something like that. Pretending like that means something or whatever. Lindsey Graham Cracker will be there and it'll look like he's constipated as usual. And he'll have this nervous, sweaty look on his face like, I wonder if anybody knows that I just vacuumed the carpet out front with Hunty and secretly want him in my dirt star. <laughs> Cori Bush will be there and she's had a rough year seeing as she's a liar dirt merchant. So she's gonna wear something crazy, something that draws attention for sure. It'll be like a pink bedazzled sombrero that says, justice for George Floyd or something like that. Ashley Biden will be there with a 10,000 foot stare. Likely hopped up on so many pharmaceutical chemicals that she's wondering to herself, I did the shower, now I'm here for this clapping. I'm standing and clapping. Joe is definitely gonna get likely mad about something and there'll be one of those like old man yells at clouds moments. How dare they? And then the negative 5% of the country that watches it live on TV will be like, is Love is Blind on or is there something else we could do? And then the next day while the country continues to burn into the ground, almost no one will care and all the headlines will be like, who do you think is going to win The Bachelor? <laughs> We're living in hell! <laughs>